So today we are gonna be talking about this monster right here, guys. This is the Igloo Journey Trailmate 70 quart cooler. This thing is absolutely enormous. In fact, when I ordered it online, I had no idea it was this big. I'd never seen it in stores. I just saw pictures, but the first time I saw pictures, I fell in love with it. I actually wanted the white one, but they didn't have that one in stock. And I'm an impatient guy, so I went ahead and ordered this one. This is the olive green. Nonetheless, it still looks absolutely awesome and I love it. At first, I thought it would be overkill because I'm like, how are we ever going to drink that many drinks? However, I forgot we're going to be bringing big slabs of meat with us to cook when we take this camping. Now, when I received this, I was still waiting for my tent. So when the big Hertz truck pulled up out front, that's what I thought it would be. Two people came walking out, one on each end, carrying an enormous box. And I'm like, that's got to be the tent. They set it down and they were like, that actually wasn't too heavy. And I'm thinking there's no way it was the tent. So I opened up the box and it was this. Wow, is this thing huge, guys. And it is loaded with awesome features. And we're going to take a look at every inch of it in just a second here. But man, this thing has a bottle opener on each side. It has enormous wheels here to roll over pretty much any kind of terrain. I've already pulled it up a set of stairs and it went up so easily. Thank God, because I would not want to try to carry this thing with ice and drinks and food in it. We've got a handle on the end here that extends so you can easily roll it behind you. And when you get there, you push these two buttons, slide it right back in. We've got a dry storage box right on the end that slides out, opens up, and it has a thick rubber lining, making it waterproof when it's closed. You can put anything in here you need to keep dry, your cell phones, your keys, medications, anything. Close it up slide it right back. You've got a storage pocket on the front here. You can put anything else in you need to carry with you. Sunscreen, glasses, bug spray, hand wipes, anything you can think of that you might need to bring with you. Gigantic wheels. Look at this, guys. These are 10 inch wheels, four inches wide with an awesome tread on them. So you can roll this thing across sand, dirt, rocks, anything. On top, we've got four cup holders and a mobile device stand. You can put a phone up there. You can put an iPad, any kind of device that fits in that little slot right there. You can stand it up. We've got tie down loops around the perimeter of the top here. So if you need to carry anything on top, like a tent, a bag, clothes, a duffel bag, anything you can think of that you might need to pull along with you on top. Wrap some rope around it, hook it to these tie-down loops, and you are good to go. On the back, we have what is labeled in the booklet as accessory holders. It actually comes with two of these. They're both just like a tube that you slide right down into place on those, and then those can hold your fishing poles, flags, stick an umbrella in here and open it up. Anything else you can think of that's on a pole that you might need to stick down in there. That is a pretty awesome feature that you wouldn't even realize that you need. We've got a drain plug on the back here. We've got these feet on the front with what they call cool riser technology, which lifts up the bottom of the cooler to allow air to flow underneath, which apparently helps to keep cool what's inside, which leads us to the four day ice retention, guys. You can fill this thing up with ice and drinks, and it's supposed to last for four days. We're gonna test that out. So let's take a look at the inside here. If we open this up, we've got a food basket. This is an enormous area in here for ice, drinks, food, anything you need to keep cool on your camping trip. If you need to keep any food dry, you can either put it in a Ziploc or put it in the bag, set it in there and slide it right up. That will hold it up above that melting ice. And connected up here under the lid is what they're referring to as a butler tray. You can see it's just like a regular tray. It has two drink holders on it. Come up front, extend your handle, set it right down there and there's your tray. So if you didn't have enough room on top, for four drinks and food. You got two more drink holders here and a whole extra tray. When you're done with that, it just goes right back into place. Turn the two little knobs and there you go. Guys, this is an awesome cooler. I paid 250 bucks for this thing. And then just a few days later, it went on sale for $200. Put it in your cart, 
watch it for a few days and just kind of watch that price because it will fluctuate. So I could have saved myself 50 bucks on this thing. All right, guys, well, I'm going to leave it at that today with this Igloo cooler. Again, this is the 70 quart Igloo Trailmate Journey cooler. Absolutely awesome. Stay tuned because we are going to do the four day ice retention test. It is supposed to be in the high 80s and 90s for the next four days, so this is a perfect time to test this out. That is gonna be in a separate video that I'm gonna film right now.